Hello friends, my name is Arnav. I am a student of 21st century learning, Rani Bagan, Bharampur. I study in class 8 in Mary Immaculate School. Today I was studying Pascal's Law, which states that the pressure exerted anywhere in a confined liquid is transmitted equally and undiminished in all directions throughout the liquid. Okay. So I was I read this and I wanted to prove for this I am doing an experiment on Pascal's law. <coughs> It's a miniature model of a hydraulic jack. So Pascal's law states that that the pressure exerted anywhere. It's, I'm exerting the pressure <coughs> in a confined liquid is transmitted equally and undiminished in all directions. So this. Okay, so what you're doing is, uh, there's a weight out here. Yeah. It could be a car, it could be anything yes, out yes. here. So, and this is like an hydraulic uh, system. And you're exerting a pressure from here. Okay, and oh wow, and this rises. And then the mechanic can go down and repair the car below it, right? And just hold it for me or no? This one? Yeah. Yeah, and just hold it for me. Great. So the, this this is where uh, the mechanic can move in and uh, they can repair the car. Fantastic. So and how is it easy to just push it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's like it's like why it's like child's play. Yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Let's Great. Do some... Let's try to increase the surface area and see what happens at the bigger. Bigger one and uh, try pushing it. Oh wow, uh, this is not that child's play, so <laughs> it's rising higher. But then, uh, Ornob is requiring both of his hands to push it. So, let me let me try doing it. Uh, can you just hold it? Hold this for me. Yeah. Uh, uh, this is this is like quite tough quite tough this is like quite tough uh, might maybe i thought Arnob is like a kid of class 8 but then even for me it's like quite tough so what's wrong like what's wrong like oh i think what's wrong is in the <coughs> initial syringe the surface area was small and now he has increased so once you increase the surface area we need to give what more force because the pressure is constant yes. but uh, pressure equal force into area yes no pressure is force by area <laughs> or no i was checking you okay it's good to do experiments but you also know your theories okay study well okay anyway so once we are increasing the area we have to give more force to this okay fantastic so that proves pascal's law and also proves what the arithmetical uh, you know uh, formula like f2 by f1 f2 is on here f1 is on this is uh, equal to a2 a2 is area of area area of this yes. and a1 is area so area. if we reduced the area of this the force on this is oh fantastic that's that's easy right yes. so you should always use a smaller surface area if you're putting this effort so that uh, it is easy for us to press it Okay, that's great, that's great, and uh, that's oh. fantastic, or no? For this reason, so I love studying in 21st century learning, as, I'm, as I do lots of, hand, lots of hands on experiment, which helps me to understand complicated concepts of physics. No, yeah, this, is, this is great. Okay, or no? Have a good time, and keep studying. Yeah, see you. Bye.